so hello everyone this is anita uh, so i am here to uh, explain the task which is given for me by techno hacks edutech internship program uh, which is uh, on cyber security which is four weeks uh, so thank you so much uh, mr sandeep kavit for giving this opportunity so today i am going to explain the task 3 which is on information gathering uh, uh, using the balticor gui based tool and we need to gather the information about the target uh, website which is http uh, slash uh, slash uh, test php uh, dot uh, valna uh, val web dot um so uh, uh, so i have already uh, installed the multigo in my windows uh, system so uh, this is how it generally looks so once if you um, Uh, once if you install it and uh, once if you register it using your uh, uh, registered email so uh, first you need to register uh, the uh, uh, first you need to uh, register to this multigo community edition which is free uh, by giving your organization details and the email so once if you give it uh, the uh, then you will be getting the access to log in to this multigo community edition so the multigo is a uh, is a tool which is used for the Uh, information gathering and uh, it gives you the uh, accurate information and uh, you will be getting all the detail uh, detail analysis of the particular website in a smarter way and uh, and it helps you in thinking and connecting the links of uh, of uh, what what domains it is collected so what is the company details and all those things so this particular particle is pre installed in kali linux but uh, I'm showing you the demonstration in my Windows, so I have installed it. Uh, but uh, the Kali Linux uh, in Kali Linux, uh, in the Kali Linux, it is already installed. So without it, I'll be showing you the demonstration of this particular uh, multigo. So first, you need to click on the machines, and next, you need to click the run machine. So you'll be able to see different type of machines here. So you can select your wished one. Uh, so uh, you can click. Uh, you are into the network domain information. So I'll be clicking my URL uh, to the network domain information because uh, for us, in order to do the uh, information gathering, uh, they have given me the URL. So let us type the URL which is given for us. Um, HTTP slash slash test uh, test php dot val valweb uh, valweb dot com slash So this is the uh, website uh, which is given for me. So now let us click finish. Uh, so once if you click uh, finish, it takes some time uh, to get the details. Uh, so yeah, you can see how it is. Um, Uh, fetching all the details. So as it is a community edition, it is saying that only uh, for twelve, uh, twelve edition it will be showing you the details. But if it is more than community edition, you will be getting the complete details of it. So now you can see uh, first from the web, uh, from the URL we have given, it is uh, uh, contacting the uh, www.mobile.com, and from that uh, you can see this is uh, uh, one uh, URL. And from that, that is connected to the Amazon.com, Amazon Industry. Dot uh, Internet and uh, some other things. And so you can see this is the net block. So net block is a block where uh, uh, some uh, uh, this is a particular block where the address ranges from it. And uh, you can also see. Uh, uh, so this is uh, so this is uh, AS. So this is the application server type. And this is the IPv4 address, so the one which looks like that. And this is the location. So this is the this is where this particular IPv4 addresses are located. It is located in the border of Oregon, United uh, States. And you can also see the Mallet.com. Uh, it is also connected to Verisign, Giga Services. Dot Viano, Mallet.com. And this is all completely in um, NS1, Mallet.com. And these are two administrators who are operating this particular. And uh, Unisex uh, Limited, Verisign, Google, Industry, who is 
uh, how who is is connected to this particular bird vector and what are the details what is the company details and all those things you can uh, once if you right click and you can see what are the properties or to the date of time you are having and uh, and also uh, uh, so once if you click on it uh, so in the properties you can see what is the name and uh, what are uh, some of the locations so once if i click on it you will be seeing the two so what is the who is gonna return uh, if uh, someone searches for it and all those particular details with a complete good uh, uh, picturization will be able to see in the multi go so uh, the green one uh, represents the website and this uh, this uh, light blue represents the network and uh, this is the ipv4 and these are the companies and these are the email addresses and uh, these are the companies and this is the ns record and this is the location and this is the website and this website is connected to the url so from the url we are connecting the website and from the website we are gathering the data which is useful for us uh, and we are seeing what what ip addresses are there what what um, urls are connected to it what what the locations are connected to it uh, we can do complete analysis by using this particular mantico community uh, edition you can uh, now if you have searched for the url you can Search directly by using the domain name field. Once you click on the domain machine and you can select the footprint, and we are writing that the domain name as www.google.com or yahoo, whatever the uh, thing you can uh, uh, search. Actually, Google. the url mistake so let us see whether uh, there are any ip addresses with that particular google.com too so yeah so it is showing some uh, things are related to the google.com so it is connected to the website domain uh, and this is the website we are having the two ip addresses are shown for that particular website along with the net blocker uh, which is of block size 256 so these are the particular details you will be able to analyze Um, when you're uh, uh, when you're uh, uh, find 